Welcome to the Important Outdoors, my name is Michael and today we're going to take a look at cast iron cooking. So if you take a look at my past videos you can see that I regularly cook with cast iron pans. There's a couple of reasons why I prefer these over other types of pans. So let's talk about that for a few minutes. So one of the main benefits of a cast iron pan is it evens out the heat. When you're cooking on an open fire, the heavy cast iron of the pan helps reduce the hot spots and distributes the heat more evenly across the pan so it doesn't burn as badly. Obviously if you're backpacking or you're ultralight, this is not gonna work for you. These pans are extremely heavy. But if you're traveling on something like a UTV or your car camping, these work out extremely well. The other benefit to cast iron is it's relatively easy to look after. You tend not to have to scrub them to get them clean. It's just a matter of putting in some warm water and allowing that to boil and then you can wipe it out and then reapply an oil such as vegetable oil or olive oil is fine to reseason the pans after each use. So this brings me around to the recent purchase I picked up from Cabela's. This is the Cabela's five piece cast iron set and I've been extremely happy with it so far. I'm gonna primarily use this cast iron set for my home cooking because I actually love it on the induction stove. I think it does a really good job of evening out that heat and the induction technology heats these pans up pretty quickly as well, which is nice. So what's included in the kit? First off, there's a 12 inch deep skillet, which has a lid as well. So it's really great for making stews, something you've got to simmer for a long time, chilies, that sort of stuff. And the lid's reversible and can be used as a skillet. Again, that's really good for frying bacon, etc. Next in the set is a five quart camp oven, which also comes with a lid and a bale handle. Very useful for campfire cooking. I actually prefer this style over the skillet type because it's easier to use on a campfire. There's also a notch in the lid that allows you to line up with a notch in the pan, which is nice if you want to reduce the liquid inside. So the lid can also be used on the 10 inch skillet, so it makes it quite versatile. Next we have a 10 inch skillet, and the 10 inch skillet does a great job making omelets. It gives it a nice brown, golden rich texture, and it's very appetizing. So to complement the kit, Cabela's includes a Dutch oven lifting tool. This is very useful for lifting the pans or lifting the lids over a hot fire, and is a bit of a must if you're gonna do some outside campfire cooking. It can also be used to support the back of a pan while you're lifting the whole thing off the fire, which again is great for safety. Finally, they also include a pair of thick leather gloves to allow you to safely maneuver the pans and pick them up and move them wherever. So that's a nice addition to have to the set. So overall, I really enjoy the set very much. The price currently I think is about $189 Canadian. And I have seen these sets on sale for less at Cabela's during different parts of the year. So keep an eye out for that. Overall, I'm really happy with the set. And the good thing is it's probably gonna be an heirloom. It's, <laughs> these things last forever. One of the main benefits of the cast iron is the way that it cooks and browns meats, the ease of taking care of them, and just the longevity. Obviously the downside is the weight, and that's gonna put off a few people. If you don't have a lot of upper body strength, if you're gonna be moving these around in the kitchen, it's really not gonna work for you. They are extremely heavy, but they are something that would last an entire lifetime. But I feel the benefits of these pans and the way they cook and the way they flavor the food somewhat is exceptional and they're so easy to clean as long as you just use a nice warm water or boiling water give them a wipe out and always reprotect them as soon as you're finished don't let them stand with water in or they will get a film of rust so let me know what you think in the comments whether you like cast iron pans or if you actually have this cabela set i'd love to know that too so until next time take care and as always, thank you very much for watching. If you like my videos, leave me a comment, maybe a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe.